Hello and welcome to the session of Five for Fifth, where today we're going to model the game Hidden Treasure from Fifth Grade Everyday Math Books. Mm -hmm. um, it's from Unit 9, and if you're interested in the SRB, uh, you can find a really nice description on page 319 of your SRB. But when you start the game, it's going to be you against your partner, and you're going to want to put something to block your view of each other's game board. Um, file folders might work really well because they come up high and you won't be able to see across to your partner. So this is your setup of the game. You against a partner, so it's only two people playing at once. Face to face, and we're called face partners. Now the object of the game. When you look at the game board, you're going to notice there's two grids. One grid is where you're going to hide a point and your partner's going to try to find your point and then the other grid is you trying to figure out where your partner's point is hidden. Now when you think about when you were a child and you played the red light green light game where you tried to get closer and closer to something or hot cold or uh, the best example is sink my battleship. It's very similar to that. So we are going to begin. I'm here with my partner and we each have our own game boards and what we're going to do without looking we're each going to pick a point <laughs> on our grid now, would you let, I'll guess yours first. Okay. Do you want to show everybody where your point is? I'm not going to look. No. You're I'm not, not going to show them? them. <laughs> oh, okay. I was going to, I'm nicer than you. Okay, here's, here's the point I picked for her to try to guess mine. Now, I'm going to say, I'm going to take a start at 6 comma 6. So, I'm going to put a mark at 6 comma 6. So, it's 6 units over and up. 6, 6. How many units away am I? Three units away. I'm three units away. I'm just making a note for myself so I remember that I'm three units away. Um, okay. I'm going to sh and now I want to show them how I came up with the three units. Perfect. Okay. If you notice, now of course she shouldn't be seeing this. but I'm not looking. But yeah, right. <laughs> this was the point that I chose. And then she chose this point. I need to tell her how many units away she is. Units are how many of these sides of the squares there are. These are the units. So it's one, two, three. Or if I went this way, one, two, three. Or even if you count it this way, one, two, three. It's always the same count. You just never can count over diagonal. So that's where she guessed, and she's three units away. So now i got to guess where I think hers is. All right, let's see. I'm going to guess that she is at three, five. This is where I think she is, over three, up five. Now she's going to tell me how many units away okay. I am. So my partner guessed 3 comma 5. That lands her here. So she is 1, 2, 3, 4, 5 units away. Or I can go this way. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So you are 5 units away with that guess. Right, I don't know good. what direction though. Right. There's now, I'm here and I know that I'm 3 units away. I could go three this way. Hmm. I could go three up, three to the side, three down. I can get creative. I can go one, two, three. Or this. Hmm. I'm going to do that. I'm going to go one, two, three. Here's my second guess. Okay. What is it? Uh, is five comma eight. Five comma eight. All right. When you're at five comma eight, you are one, two, three, four units away. Oh. Okay, four. So I was three away here. Okay. I think I just figured it out. Okay. Uh -uh. Yeah. <laughs> okay. So now I guessed for hers, I guessed three, um, three comma five. Okay. And I was five units away. So I can do the same thing. I can't go five units this way, but I could go like one, two, three, four, five and end up down there. Or I can go one, two, three, four, five, and end up all the way down here. You just have to count five units somewhere. So I think I'm going to go over and up. One, two, three, four, five. I'm going to guess right here. So I'm going to tell my partner that I think her point is located at four, comma nine. Four nine. Yeah. Okay. Here's her guess. Four comma nine. She's only two units away. Uh oh. Getting closer. Getting warmer. Okay, now we're back to our guessing here. I'm four units away for this one and three units away. If I come down one, two, three, four, 
that lands me at 5 comma 4 and it would be 3 units away. Now I'm going to guess that 5 comma 4. And you're right. That's it. That's my point. Yay. That's okay. the point I chose. 5 comma 4. So she wins since I went first. Each person oh, had God, enough you turns. Went for, okay. I went first and so she ended. If Wonderful. I hadn't gone first you then would go. I could go again and then she would guess. Okay. Gotcha. So that's the idea. Now if you notice, can I show them one more thing partner here? Yeah, this was, yours. it's okay, yeah, just, if you notice, this said game board one, and this is what you're going to be playing um, in section nine one, and then when you move on to section nine three, we now have moved up to game board two, and I think it's very obvious what the difference is in these game boards. These include positive and negative integers. So you're dealing with positive numbers to the right, negative numbers to the left, positive numbers going up, negative numbers going down. The procedure of the game is exactly the same. We're both going to hide a point. Okay. Do you want me to go guess first? Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Let me guess two two. Two comma two. So that's positive two. Posit positive two, positive two. Positive two comma positive two. So you are four units away. Okay. Four. And wait a minute. Oh, sorry. That's okay. I just wrote your guess on my paper. <laughs> oh, okay. We. <laughs> okay. Here comes. Here comes. Sorry, sorry, sorry. Four sorry. units. So. Okay. Mm. All right. Here I go. Alrighty. I'm gonna guess where you are. I'm guessing that you are over three, three, comma, negative three. I think you're three, three. Three negative three. Three comma negative three. Three comma. You are only two units away. Oh, two units. That's it. Okay. All right. Okay. Now, my last guess was here, and I was four units away. Well, I I don't think I'm going to be in the first quadrant any longer. I'm just going to go down. One, two, three, four. Let's see what this does. Two negative two. Two comma negative two. You did it. You sunk my battleship. That's again. that's the point. That's it. You went uh, straight down. I just went. I thought to myself, if I go four this way, the four right. this, I figured I'm out of the first quadrant. So I just went down. I could have gone anywhere, but Good. okay. Right. Now you want to guess your next? I want to try to guess yours because you're when two I was away. here, it was mm -hmm. two units away. So once again, I can either go up to, or I can go up and over. There's a lot of ways I can go. I kind of like the up and over. I'm going to guess that you are here. You are, well, that's where I was. Wouldn't that be funny? Um, were you at two <laughs> negative two? No. no? Okay. But you're, you're um, two units away at two <laughs> negative two. So this is still two it's units still away. Still two units. Two. One, two. Oh, how bad if it was one negative three? That's it. There it is. Because <laughs> as soon as she said that, I'm two units this way, Perfect. and I would be two units that way. How cute. Perfect. But it, that does, doesn't change the game that much. No, it's it. just the fact that you now are, you know, before we just had quadrant one and now we have all four quadrants. Um, so that's it. That's the hidden treasure game. Um, have fun with it. It really is a lot of fun. And uh, we will see you at the next five for fifth.